I don't want to take my clothes off. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to those of us who went to school, <laughs> who were in middle and high school in the early 2000s, okay? We have fun. All right, all right, okay, let me get serious. So today's video is about the warm weather must-haves every curvy woman should own. <laughs> My name is Chi Chi and on this channel we cover fashion, beauty, and a lifestyle. So if that's the kind of stuff you're into then sis you are in the right place. Welcome. And of course if you're subscribed, sis, sis, I'm so glad you came back. Okay, without further ado, let's jump into this. Okay, so we already know that when you are a curvy girl, the heat hits different. And if you're anything like me, I don't wanna say hyperperspiration, but perspire a little bit more than the, the average girl, then summer can be a little bit challenging. So in this video, my aim is to really share with you those essential things that makes you know, summer a little bit more enjoyable. Make sure to stay tuned because I'm gonna be sharing with you my top warm weather tip if you are a curvy girl this summer. So the first must have item is going to be a strapless bra, sis. Especially in 2021 where I feel like cutouts are having such a huge moment. The backlist is really having a moment right now and you can't really, you know, try that trend if you do not have a good strapless bra. Now we talked a lot about undergarments and how important foundations are and how important finding a supportive bra is to really helping create a wonderful canvas for your outfits. Now I know that based on the response I've gotten, I've gotten two sets of response. For some of my girls who have a wider trunk but a smaller cup, they always struggle with finding um, strapless bras. And the other is for my girls who are heavily endowed and are very, very busty. So for my girls with the with wider trunks and smaller cups, my best tip is to invest in bandeau bras. Now, the reason why I recommend a bandeau bra is because since you have a smaller cup, you do not need as much support. So a bandeau bra will help to, I guess, compress and keep your chest area in place. Now it won't give you, you know, cleavage, like a padded bra or like a bra that is designed to, you know, accentuate or enhance the bust, but it will keep your girls in place. Now on the flip side for my girls who are really, really well endowed and struggle with finding um, strapless bras that actually give you the support. Girl, I have done my research and I have found some great places where you can find those large larger cups in strapless bras. So one of those brands is gonna be Alomi. The second brand, of course, is one that we are all familiar with, and that's going to be Lane Bryant. And I'm sorry if you're hearing noise, it's seriously thundering outside right now. And then the final, this is one that I recently um, found out about and I've heard good reviews, is going to be this bra right here. Now, I have been told that this bra will give you all of the support you need. Just looking at the bra, you can see that it's kind of cut and shaped differently, whereas the cup really goes in like a C. So it definitely helps to hold your girls up, cup your breast and keep them exactly where they need to be in place. Also, it does come with straps so you can use it as a convertible bra if you would prefer. So my ladies, if you have a wider trunk and smaller breasts, I've got you. And if you have a much larger cup, I've got you covered as well. So the next thing I think that every woman should own especially my curvy girls during the summer is your wind honey you need to have that Beyonce energy that wind okay aka your portable fan okay this will help your makeup stay in place okay it will keep the moisture at bay but it'll also allow you to ventilate you know areas that may really get steamy as the day goes on if you're a curvy girl you have more creases and more curves and places that 
you know, sweat and bacteria can kind of pool. So having your own portable fan, in my opinion, is a game changer, especially since so many of us are doing more outdoor stuff, you know, as we're coming out of this panoramic, you know, I think a portable fan is just a must have. They make with the flexible legs that you can actually like contort to fit anywhere so it stays in place. I can't tell you how many times I've been on shoots during the summertime that it's just coming clutch to help keep my makeup in place to help keep you know just the sweat because there's nothing like arriving to a location especially if you wear something that is like a solid color and like sweat is just dripping all off you like that's not cute so definitely invest in one two or three honey because some things always get lost invest in a like at least two of those pans because trust me they come in clutch now if you do not want to splurge on an actual you know motorized fan you can also paper fan as well either or will come in clutch this summer as a hippie girl as a girl with some thighs okay and that is going to be chafing okay and a chafe solution you know since I was a little girl like I always used to opt for pants in the summer even when I wanted to wear dresses and skirts because I really didn't think there was a solution for chafing until I discovered the monostat chafe gel and honestly it's come in clutch so there's two ways that you can really avoid chafing one is to create a physical barrier and one is to help kind of ease the friction of both of your thighs rubbing together if you're gonna be out for a long time if you know you're gonna be moving a lot I personally recommend a physical barrier so that would be a pair of shorts just because it also helps to absorb some of the moisture if you start sweating so I have actually been testing out a couple of these shorts just so that I can give you guys an informed decision I found a super affordable version but I also found I want to say more it's not that much more expensive but it does cost a little bit more and it has cooling technology if you run hot like me that cooling technology to me is a must-have but I did try both types or both sets of shorts just so that I could give you you know my honest opinion and personally I would spend a couple more dollars for the more expensive pair of shorts just because of that cooling technology I would also opt for lighter colors if you're going to wear the shorts and make most of them come in nude and black I would opt for a nude or a brown if you can find it and kind of stay away from the blacks just because it's really hot as we all know dark colors tend to keep heat in so those are my tips now on the other spectrum if you do not want to do the shorts because I know when you you're hot putting on another layer can just exacerbate the situation then there are a couple of options that I can recommend the first one would be the monostat chafe gel now with this one you will have to reapply especially if you get hot actually for all of them you're gonna have to reapply and that's why I prefer the shorts over these products but some days you just it's just too hot or you just don't want that extra layer they come in really handy so the monostat one is one I know and love and what I specifically like about this is that it has a powder finish I'm somebody who doesn't really like a lot of grease and oil on my skin because I'm naturally oily so I like the fact that it creates kind of like a powder finish barrier for you versus the other options that I've tried that are more of kind of like oily consistency so of course I'm going to link Link the items that I talk about in this video for you guys in the description bar another great product is going to be the chafe zone stick now this does have more of an oily consistency and then the final product which I'm yet to try I actually ordered it and somehow I don't know my order got canceled it's going to be the mega babe thigh rescue now this I've heard a lot of from fellow influencers one of the babe that actually created it is somewhat of an influencer as well she works in PR oh my god can y'all hear me it is thundering like crazy okay I hope you can hear me she also created um the bust dust as well which you can actually put underneath your bust to help with perspiration and moisture so I of course again will link everything I talk about in the description down below wow it is so loud I apologize y'all I apologize if it's Wow. So the next item is going to be a hygiene towelette. So these towelettes kind of run the gamut. Some of them are as simple as like water wipes. If you haven't tried water wipes, sis, 
literally they will change your life but that's another story but you also have deodorizing towelettes that have like antiperspirant attributes to them and then you of course you have the towelettes for the intimate area bare minimum you should have something that you can use to wipe down any areas that may have gotten a little funky or or <laughs> let me not be too tmi or a little musty over the course of the day um these towelettes are great for like refreshing those areas like under your breasts your intimate areas your underarms etc etc you know if you have like rolls or folds in between those areas these towelettes are the goat and I feel like are must-have especially if you are going to be out all day and you might be going from a day to night function and you don't have time to make it home to like take another shower then you need to have these towelettes in your on you at all times because you never know when you need them now now, some that I've tried include the Vagisil ones. I've also tried a deodorizing one. It was kind of like an antiperspirant towelette. For some reason, it's like, I can't think of the name right now, but I'll definitely link to it if I remember. And again, I love water wipes because it's essentially water, but it really helps to like refresh and it lifts off so much for something that's basically water. So the next must have that every curvy woman should own is going to be sunscreen. And I know that there's still some kind of debate on sunscreen, but sis, literally there should be no debate, okay? We all need protection from excess UVA and UVB rays. You know, keep those free radicals at bay because they cause not so nice things to happen on our skin. And I don't know about you, but I want this skin, okay, to look like I'm 25. The point is that we need protection. Now, I can totally understand as a chocolate colored girl, the love-hate relationship that a lot of us have with sunscreen because growing up, or let's say 10 years ago, the only options that were there were options that made me look gray. But thanks to technology, we now have a nice assortment of sunscreens that really don't leave that white cast on the skin. There's a debate between whether you want a physical sunscreen, like a mineral one or a chemical one. And on the mineral side, there aren't as many options that keep away that gray, but definitely the other side, you have quite a few options. Like this one that I have here that I've talked about literally. When I found this sunscreen, I started wearing sunscreen daily. It changed everything for me because I could put it on and leave my house and not look gray and not look crazy. <laughs> so they, I will link to it in so many other options for you guys down below. If you're following me on Instagram, you know I've been harping about sunscreen all summer long and I still get comments from people when they see me putting on this sunscreen like, oh my God, that sunscreen's clear? Yes, it is clear, it applies clear on your skin and every girl no matter what shade you are no matter what race you are we all need sunscreen unless you live like inside of a cave and then exception to the rule because you do need that vitamin d but if you live in a cave you're probably not used to having that much sun so you probably still need sunscreen to keep you from burning just saying <laughs> All right, so if you are enjoying this video so far and you've gotten a, some value out of it, sis, do your girl a solid and hit that like button and lets me know that you appreciate these tips and tricks and, you know, tells me to make more videos like this where I share value information now you guys know this is a fashion and lifestyle channel so I cannot do a must-have video or an essentials video and I'll talk about something um, related to fashion this was hard for me because I wanted to only pick one fashion item and that is the bonus item but honestly I could not so we're gonna have two bonus items today okay thumbs up this video just for that all right, <laughs> the must have warm weather item every curvy girl should own is going to be a tank dress. This is going to be your summer 
workhorse. This is going to be an item that you will reach after over and over again. It's such a simple item and that's the beauty of it, right? You can just wear a pair of sneakers and run out the house if you're okay, you know, showing your arms. And if you're not, you can throw on a denim jacket if it's on a cooler day, okay? Um, and then if you have to run out on a date that night or you have something to do at night, you can throw on a lightweight, like white blazer over it and some wrap sandals and a clutch and then you have a night outfit. So it is such a must have piece because it can literally be dressed down, dressed up, whatever vibe you want to create. If you're on the sporty side, you can wear some sneakers and a baseball hat. You know, if you're on a more girly side, a cute wraparound sandal, a fedora, like you could do so much with this. A kimono would totally make it very girly and pretty. That is just a must have. Now on the other must have that actually pairs really well with a tank dress is going to be a shirt dress. Says, I have talked about shirt dresses so on blue because they're so, 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 so integral. It's like the one piece you should pack when you're going on vacation. Even if you're not going on a vacation, that white button down shirt dress will take you from pool cover up to a crisp shirt that you can tuck into some jeans for dinner and a pair of heels to a dress that you can belt and wear with some mules or pointy toed flats and wear to work with a structured bag. Like it will just go everywhere you need to go. Look for um, fabrics like linen that are very breathable or cotton so you don't get overheated with the sleeves. But honestly, those two items, every woman, every woman should own them. And I dare say you should own at least two of each just so that you can really get to wear as much as you want and so that you're not putting so much that one item, but it's just a must, must, must have. And if you're following me on Instagram, you know that I've already done videos showing you ways to wear a shirt dress. Speaking of Instagram, when I'm not on YouTube, you can always find me there, okay? I share daily fashion and lifestyle inspo, all of my new and stuff stuff. I'm always doing unboxing. Like, you guys get so mad at me when things sell out. And my biggest hack for you would be to follow me on Instagram because they get the tea first. I mean, I've said it before in prior videos, but you know, it takes me some time to set up the lights and film a video and have it edited, et cetera, et cetera. And stuff be so, oh my God. Things sell out so fast. Sometimes I'll share something that I found that's cute that I have in my car on Instagram. And by the time I go to check out, it's gone. I didn't even get it. I didn't even get it. Um, so just keep that in mind. I'm not trying to keep anything from you guys. And I always try to put alternatives for you if the item I'm sharing is gone. So everything I shared in this video from the strapless bra to the tank dresses, to the fans, to the towelettes, you name it, it is all linked for you guys in the description box down below and on my Amazon shop. So basically on Amazon, not only did I create a specific category for this video, I also have categories on everything from my kitchen favorites to my favorite designer inspired bags and shoes, okay? If you want that Bottega from the Bottega, you know that look, okay? I have done my best to curate everything for you guys. I also have home office finds, like decor finds, like that rack that I always get questions about and that plant back there that I <laughs> as well. I've rounded up every single thing for you guys in my Amazon shop so that you can check it out. It's categorized for your ease. And the reason why I'm mentioning this is because Prime Day is coming. Okay. I don't know if I'm the only one that's excited, but you should be excited because if you shop on Amazon as much as I shop on Amazon, <laughs> then you know that Prime Day is basically the Black Friday for Amazon, okay? So many crazy deals and saving my coins gets me excited, okay? It gets me excited. So everything is gonna be linked for you guys in the description if you want the tea on this hat, on this top, which may you may or may not have already seen in a haul. But if you haven't, it's coming soon. But I'll link it for you if it's still available, okay, in the description down below. And if I miss something, sis, definitely let me know in the comments down below and check 
the shop my outfits or shop this video link. I'm not sure what I named it, but if you're on mobile, you can actually click the arrow, drop down arrow. I think it's on the left side. Nope, I think it's on the right side. <laughs> And yeah, all the information you want is there. All right, so if you enjoyed this video, want more videos where I share tips and tricks, outfit ideas, etc., etc., then sis, all you have to do is subscribe now. We'd love to have you in the family. Check out this video and check out this video. Don't forget to rate, comment, subscribe, and share. And until next time, sis. Stay blessed.